OK, so um, again, guys, to graph angles is relatively basic. All right, so if we're going to be graphing 400 degrees, um, I think it's just kind of go just do what you know. Like if we're doing standard form, we're always starting here, right? And again, counterclockwise is positive, clockwise is going to be negative. So we know from here to here is 90, right? Straight angle from here to here is 180, and just keep on adding 90s. This would be 270, all the way around is 360, right? So we went all the way around here. And then if I just need to go, um, so at 360, I just need to go 40 more degrees more, right? Which is, I know 45 degrees is half a 90, so it's probably just going to be something like that. OK, so just make sure when you're drawing your angle, you can have angles that are larger than three, that are revolution, right? Then going all the way around. Um, just make sure you have it in, you know, you have the direction, and then obviously you're showing the arrow. OK, so that is my 400 degrees. So then what about if I need to go 90 degrees? Well, I know 90 degrees is from here to here. But if I'm doing negative 90 degrees, that's again going to start here and then just rotate down to there, right? Which would produce a 90 degree angle. So that's going to be negative 90 degrees. Cool?